In this app note, we will be opening a new SG2 program and linking the SG2 software to the SG2 programmable logic relay. In this example, we will be using the SG2 client software version 3.4 in conjunction with Windows 7 operating system. The program will be shown in the ladder logic format. Step 1 is to connect the programming cable. First, remove the plastic connection cover from the SG2 RS232 port using a small flat blade screwdriver. Second, install the rectangular RS232 end of the programming cable into the SG2 programmable relay port. Third, plug the opposite end of the programming cable into the computer. The next step in the process is to connect power. Connect power to the SG2 programmable relay following the instructions that are included with the product. To minimize the risk of potential safety problems, follow all applicable local and national codes that regulate the installation and operation of your equipment. It is your responsibility to determine which codes should be followed and to verify that the equipment, installation, and operation is in compliance with these codes. Do not connect or disconnect wires or connectors while power is applied to the circuit. Refer to the instruction sheet that is included with the product for additional directions and circuit protection recommendations. Next, apply power to the SG2 programmable relay. Step 3 in the process is opening the SG2 programming software. First, select Windows Start, All Programs, the Tico folder, the SG2 client folder, and finally the SG2 client. The SG2 client window will open. For this example, we will open a new ladder logic program. Select new ladder logic program button to open the program. Next, we will select the model type for the new ladder logic program. For this example, we will use the SG2-10HR-A. Select OK. At this point, the ladder logic programming screen will appear. The final step in the process is linking the SG2 programmable relay to the SG2 programming software. Open the Operation tab at the top left of your screen. Select Link COM port. The Link COM port window will open. The port shows the COM port where the SG2 cable is plugged into. The communication port location is automatically assigned when the SG2 programming cable is installed into the computer. Select the Link button to link the SG2 programmable relay unit to the SG2 programming software. Once you press the Link button, you will see a Connect Successfully message open on your screen. Select OK to complete the linking process. You have successfully linked the SG2 programmable relay with the SG2 client software.